The mridangam is an Indian percussion instrument of ancient origin. It is the main rhythmic accompaniment in a Carnatic music ensemble. It is also used extensively as an accompaniment for Bharatanatyam and other dance performances. The mridangam has been played by Indians for more than 2000 years. Referred to as Tannumai, the earliest mention of the mridangam is found in Sangam literature. Detailed references to it are found in works like Silapadikaram as also in the Natya Shastra. In ancient Hindu sculptures and epics, the mridangam is often depicted as the instrument of choice for deities like Ganesha and Nandi. Nandi is said to have played this drum during Shiva's Tandava dance, so it is known as Devavadyam or divine instrument. The mridangam is a two-sided drum whose hollowed body is made out of jackfruit wood with layers of stretched leather skins covering both ends. The two sides are laced to each other with straps around the drum. These straps stretch out the circular membranes allowing them to resonate when struck. The two membranes are of different widths helping to produce both bass and treble sounds from the same drum. Mridangams are of two types, kuchi and kappi. In kuchi, thin wooden sticks are inserted under the top layer. This gives the kuchi mridangam its distinctive vibration. In kappi, small stones are inserted and crushed. The kappi produces a tabla-like sound but with more vibration. The left side is called toppi or idandalai, left head. This is the wider aperture that produces the bass, lower pitch sounds. The right side is called karanai or valandalai, right head. This is the smaller aperture that produces higher pitch sounds. The black disc at the center called sadam or karanai gives the mridangam its distinct metallic timbre. The richness of sound that can be produced in a single instrument is the beauty of the mridangam. The combination of two inhomogeneous circular membranes helps in creating unique and distinct harmonics. Pioneering work on these harmonics was done by Nobel winning physicist Sir C. V. Raman. Over the years, especially during the early 20th century, great maestros arose, defining schools of Mridangam with distinct playing styles like the Tanjavur and the Pudukotai schools. The virtuosos Parni Subramanyam Pillai, Palakad Mani Ayer, C.S. Murugabhupati are referred to as the Mridangam Trinity, owing to their contributions to the art. Senior Vidwans like Umayar Puram K. Shivaraman, Trichy Shankaran, Karekudi Mani and many other brilliant players are highly regarded by Karnatic Rasikas. It is widely used in Carnatic music performances that are now popular all over the world. As the principal rhythmic accompaniment, Pakkavadyam, the Mridangam has a place of prime importance, ensuring all artists keep their timing while providing support to the main artist. <laughs>